Hello, I'm Dr. Stephen Fox. I've written uh, Dreams Whispered Advice and Dreams Guide to the Soul. Today, I want to interpret a dream uh, and d take a different tact. I, I frequently go over every detail of a dream. Uh, sometimes it's best, uh, in, especially in a complicated dream, uh, to go for the theme. Uh, uh, sometimes the overall theme will give you more, the main message, and then you can tear apart the details later. Uh, this dream uh, uh, was by a woman, and I want to read the dream uh, quickly uh, through first and then uh, give you my uh, thematic interpretations. And so the dream goes, I had this dream last night. There was a bomb that was supposed to come down and destroy us. They couldn't stop it from coming. There was a countdown of when it was supposed to hit. So everyone was going to their loved ones. My mom, who passed away, was there, and I was spending time with her. My friends, Misty and Brandon, were there, too, with their kids. Um... There was this carnival there with rides and games. We were all, we all knew the countdown had begun and soon we would all be gone forever. First there was panic and then acceptance. And me and my mom and my friends and everyone else began to play at the carnival. We all were laughing and having fun. A few people were still panicking this one special guy was in control of a ride. My friends were going to go on it, and I was afraid to, because he was panicking so bad he was losing concentration on the ride. Time went by, and the countdown finished. We were all having so much fun we forgot about the countdown and realized that it was over, but we were still alive. I just woke up, so this is fresh in my head. Um, so you have a situation where, um, uh, every person in the dream is a different, uh, part of her. Uh, men tend to go with actions. Women tend to go with emotions. Uh, these are, are mostly, mostly her female friends, uh, which makes sense, uh, that it's a very emotional dream and it's about how to handle her emotions. And basically... Uh, they fear that the end of the world is coming. You know, you have that feeling that something bad is happening. It's like your world is ending, okay, or it's going to end. You fear that it's going to end uh, and that you, you're just waiting for that other shoe to drop. And frequently you wait for that other shoe to drop and the shoe never does drop. Um, and that's what, what's happening in this dream. Um, in fact, the dream makes a, a big thing about uh, contrasting their fear of a, of a countdown to the end of the world. It contrasts that with them being at a carnival and having fun and being involved with rides. Um, she, it's all about her fears. She fears going on the ride, or her friend fears going on the ride, uh, one ride, because uh, one of the men uh, in charge of the ride uh, wasn't in control. He was uh, thinking about the countdown too much instead of uh, focusing on the ride, helping people to have fun. Uh, so, uh, and, and the thing they fear happening never comes. Uh, but they they have fun in spite of the countdown. And in fact, uh, the doom and gloom that they predict never happens. Uh, they enjoy the carnival and it ends and, and things are fine. And so this is a dream <clears throat> where you could get lost in the details, but the overall thing is her emotional world is full of fears that her world is going to come to an end uh, and the dream is directly advising that she have more fun and concentrate on having 
the fun uh, and and quit w ruining her fun uh, with worries uh, because what she fears uh, is going to happen never does happen which is like 90% of the time usually in the world as we know it that, uh, that the fears get out of bounds uh, we exaggerate them things aren't as bad as we we think uh, they are um, it's the apprehension of something bad happening rather than the bad thing actually happening uh, that uh, really uh, makes people panic and, and, and frequently is a big part of panic disorder. Um, so I'm, I'm Dr. Stephen Fox. I'm a clinical psychologist. Uh, this would be a dream of someone uh, uh, who had panic disorder uh, and they're frequently worried about the worst happening instead of, of, of giving themselves a break and, and the dream is directly advising that they give themselves a break and focusing uh, on ha having fun because the world's not going to end. Uh, this is Dr. Stephen Fox. Uh, dream on. Uh, have good dreams. Um, let yourself enjoy the moment uh, and keep having good dreams. Uh, good night.